where I'm still in your presence. Oh, nice, nice now. Lord, speak to me now. You have all my attention. I will linger and listen. I can't miss a thing. Lord, I know my heart wants more. Surrender all and all
this morning, I just feel perhaps some of us deep down, we really desire a touch from God. But there are things that hold us back. The scripture that came to me this morning, Proverbs 4, verse 23, says, So above all, God, the affections of your heart, for they affect all that you are. Pay attention to the welfare of your innermost being, for from there flows the wellspring of life. God wants us to guard the affections of our hearts and pay attention to our innermost being, because out of it spring the issues of our lives. Maybe you want to be close to God, but the pressures of life, the need to put your security in other things, possessions, assets, has become the affection of your heart. God wants us to once again set our eyes on things above and not things that moth and rust can come and destroy. God says heaven and earth will pass away, but His Word will remain forever. This morning, will you let God be the affections of your hearts once again? Like how you had, like how He had been before. Like the song says, God wants us to open up our hearts again to Him. That's right, pioneers, all members of this church, allow Jesus and His Word to become the affections of your heart once again. Like how you would when you were younger, when we hide His Word in our heart and we walk with Him, we will have life and peace. We will have life and peace. We will have life and peace. Holy Spirit, touch us once again. Touch us once again. on you everything else is sinking sand we stand upon that rock the rock of salvation
Just stretch out your hands to Him.